So let's have a look at Firewall D. So in the Linux kernel, there is NetFilter. And NetFilter is a firewalling functionality that has always been around. Now in older versions of Red Hat Enterprise Linux, to manage it, there was IP tables. In RHEL 7, you could still use IP tables, but it's not the default management interface anymore. The default management interface is Firewall D. And you should make a choice here. And I think the choice is obvious. It's towards the future, and the future is Firewall D anyway. So skip IP tables and concentrate on Firewall D. The design purpose of Firewall D was to make it really easy. And you will notice during this lesson that indeed it is really easy. To work with Firewall D, you have interfaces. And each interface you will assign, assign to a zone. That can be a private zone for your private network, in which almost nothing is filtered. It can be a public zone for a server that is connected directly to the internet. Or it can be a demilitarized zone, for example. So that would be the first thing to start with, to assign your interfaces to zones. And next, you need to connect services to zones. And really, that makes it very easy, because Many services are available by default, and you will learn in the latest sub-lesson of this lesson that configuring your own services really is easy to do. And once you have configured these services and made them available, there's just a couple of easy-to-use command line utilities that you can use to build your own firewall. And you will learn that in the next sub-lesson.